In this tutorial, we're gonna we'll give the picture some color. First thing you want to do is select your lasso tool, which is what I've done. Right now, I'm outlining uh, his helmet. Once you have that done, you can uh, give it a little bit of color and spoof up your image. I'm just about done right now. After that, you want to go to Image, Adjustments, and then Hue and Saturation. You want to click the Colorize, make sure that's check marks. If you don't want to go through all that, you can just hit Control U and that will bring up the Hue and Adjustments in the menu. I use the color 97 as the hue, 13 as the saturation, and negative 55 as the lightness. I wrote it down so when I do edit, when I do colorize his shirt and his pants, I can have the same color and I won't have to keep finding it. After that, you want to hit Control D to deselect. If you do make an error with the, like you click the wrong spot or something, you just hit backspace once and then you can continue on outlining your uh, spot you want to colorize. So don't worry if you, you know, accidentally click off the page or anything like that. Everything's fixable. Open up your hue and saturation menu, control U once again. Check mark, colorize, and uh, change his skin color. I didn't know what color to pick. I couldn't get close enough, really. I picked something I thought would maybe look like a skin color. If I messed around more, I probably could have found the right color to use. The color I used for the his skin in that picture was uh, 43 for the hue, 31 for the saturation, and plus 1 for the lightness. Right now I'm outlining a shirt. Well, when I was outlining, I kind of outlined the whole shirt. I didn't do the binoculars first, so the strings on the binoculars, so they all got changed. But I went back and fixed that. The outlining doesn't have to be perfect, but it has to be close. I used the lasso tool for outlining just because with the magnetic one you kind of need a, a picture where you can tell the guy from the background or the object you're outlining from the background
I'm just about done out ironing right now. Unfortunately, I only got the one guy outlined. It would have took me well over 10 minutes to finish the whole picture, but at the end, I will show you the whole picture done, even though I only got half the one guy done. <laughs> Open up to you in saturation, control, control U, check my color eyes. I did write down the color I used for his helmet, so I just used that color again. After that, you can see that I colored his binoculars a little bit. You can't really notice because it's so dark. But I outlined that anyways, and I changed it to a darker color. I opened up my uh, human saturation menu again. I colorized even though I probably didn't need to since I was only changing it to black or a dark color. If you do color color something and you don't like the color after you selected that color and deselected your object, you can just type Control Z and it'll select it again. So don't worry if you make a color mistake. If you do end up coloring something and you use the same exact colors as you did before but it just doesn't look the same you could always go into your menu and uh, go to let's see here image adjustments and levels and mess around with the shadows and stuff make it darker lighter unfortunately I didn't have to do that in the part of the tour that I'm showing you but in case it does happen you'll know what to do Unfortunately, that's all I could do in this tutorial, but I will post the end result.